Uh, so here we are, the beginning of the coup, and this is the special movement for the Abwehr and plot to assassinate Hitler. And I started off with uh, Dr. or whatever. Moving from here, he's got a, eight movement points. He goes one. He decides to attack. That's going to cost him uh, two extra. So that would go. He was at eight. One, two, three. He was at five. Eight versus three would be a five normally, but he has a plus three bonus because he doesn't have to worry about not having killed Hitler yet. So. We're on the eight table. I rolled a six. Attacker eliminated. Bang, he's gone. It's looking really, really grim. I've got to try to cut a way through. Uh, and I look at these leaders here. I can neutralize for one action these guys. Uh, but that's a pretty limited number and I need to cut a hole through and I wanted to get rid of some of these heavy hitters. Well, I'm gonna have to uh, activate Canaris for this attack now. Let's see how he does. Oh hey, I might as well do it live, huh? All right, so we start him out at nine and he's gonna cut through. That's one movement point. Two more for the attack. He's now on the nine table. This is the same one. This could kill him on a six. Five. It's an N. He's neutralized. Wolf. Okay, that means he can move through Wolf, but he can't sit on him. So he's got to go one, two more. And we go here. Now he's got a bit of a problem because he can't attack this. This is in the fortress. But Himmler is this massive block. How do you get through Himmler? I don't know. But it's got to be done. I don't have a counter to counteract him. So first I'm going to attack uh, Mueller, I guess. Uh, I think I'm on the six table against him. Right? No, I should be on the eight table. One, I eliminate him. There he goes. Now, I have the option to advance here, which I'll take. Now, did I spend? I don't know. I think so. But now I got a problem. I got Himmler. What the hell do I do about Himmler? I could hit this, Runestadt. I think I've got to. I think I've got to go for Runestadt because Himmler on the zero, I mean, I could neutralize him, 50-50 chance, but let me get rid of Himmler, or let me get rid of Runestep before anything else, if I can. Nine versus six is three, plus six brings me to the six table. That's not great, a six can still kill me. How about a two? That's a defender retreat. Does he have anywhere? Yeah, he can retreat here. Uh, I don't think I paid the cost for that. I got one more attack. I've got to go on the zero table against Himmler. If I can neutralize Himmler, maybe good stuff will happen. And I'll get out of the way with that advance. That's my last movement. Four, attacker eliminated. Boom, there goes my best guy. <sighs> Not looking good. I got one more unit I can activate. I got to find which one I want to use. This is going to be my last goal. All right, but I can't get Hitler. I don't have enough strength. I simply do not. In fact, I think it's nearly impossible to hit Hitler. Well, Hitler, um, I'm looking at this. If I want to get Hitler, I've got to come in. Say I come this way, one, two, now nah, I've got to get this guy. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's say I can get to Hitler and attack him. He's, I, there's nothing that has a strength of ten. Is it impossible? 
Uh, what am I missing here? Maybe there's no defensive bonus. Let me look and see if I can find that. Honestly, I think it's impossible to kill Hitler <laughs> uh, under any circumstances. The highest strength leader is a nine. Well, not under any, because... Oh, the second is the high, uh, differential bonus. Oh, it's plus five, not plus three. Okay, so maybe we can. All right, let's try it. One. Puts me to a seven. I spend two for the coup. Yeah, it's never lower than plus five. Uh, gotcha. Okay. So I don't know if those destructions were even legit. All right, so I'm at plus nine on this guy. Gotcha. Boom, he's gone. I'll take the free move. It doesn't really help. Okay. One, two, three more. And now I'm at, oh, plus a lot. Uh, plus nine. Boom. He's gone. I don't have enough movement to get myself up to Hitler and attack him. But I can get close. One, two, and I have moved everyone. Now, we're done with that initial coup phase. And who starts? The Abware player gets to go first. Now, at the end of the coup turn is where the penalty comes. So I've got to kill Hitler now to have a reasonable chance because that plus three bonus, no way. All right, let's try it. We're in coup turn one, boom. I've got this guy, Glavarius, in place. He's an eight versus a 10, that's a minus two. I'm on the three table. Pretty much, I need to get a one. I need to get Hitler out of that uh, emplacement and nothing else will do. There's two action, and let's see. Five, attack or eliminated. Okay, that didn't work well. Now, it's an SS turn. The SS wants to look for someone whom they believe to be a threat. That's really the only issue here. Who could do damage? That's this guy and this guy. These guys are doing some damn good job there. So I'm going to launch him to hit Oster here. I've got seven movement points. And let's move. One, two. Now, two to make the attack. And I'm at plus six total. Plus one because my strength is one higher than his defense. Plus five for the coup advantage. I get a two that's a defender retreat. He has to find a place to retreat. There's nowhere he can go without being in his zone. He's dead. I can advance. And now I can make another attack. And I'll attack this guy, I guess, at a five. One, defender eliminated. Bang, he's gone. And I can advance again, and that's important because it's putting me into a blocking position. Now I'm gonna turn him to indicate that he's already gone and it is an abware turn. And they have almost no chance. This is about all I've got. Let's launch him. He's only got six movement points. He's not gonna get to Hitler. One, two, three, four, five. He can't get there. Nobody can get there. It is over for the Abvar. Uh, now, is there any chance of survival for them? 
not really. Uh, <laughs> hiding in the headquarters and maybe popping out late. I don't know. All right. Well, let's see what we can do. Guess we'll launch him. He's only got five movement points. I spend two on an attack. He's on the four table. One, he kills this SS guy. I'll pop out. I can make another attack. I'm not sure I really want it to pop out. I'll stay back here. I'll attack him. And that is on the five table. Three, I've neutralized him. Not too big a deal. Okay, we're back to uh, an SS turn. I'm going to bring the big guns in and use Himmler here. He's got nine actions. Let's get him moving. One, eh, let's take a shot on this guy. I, nah, that guy's not going to do anything. One, two, three, four actions. Slides it down to a five. I spend two to make an attack on this one that I really want. I'm on the seven table. Oops, there goes Himmler. Ouch. All right. Now we're over on the uh, Abwehr again. And they want to make an attack. Uh, who can they attack? Well, I'm wanting to get near Hitler. I don't think I'm going to be able to kill Hitler. So it's other things I have to aim at. Right. So... Let's look for dangerous things. I can't get through there. I just don't have very many good pieces left. I'll activate him with his seven. One, two, three. Now he's a five plus five is ten. He's going to be on the three table. Can that do it? Probably not. It neutralizes. That helps a little bit. Not much. Yeah, it's just not gonna. It's not gonna work out. Uh, I'll move another space. I'll make an attack against good old Ribbon Trop here, and that is gonna be. Uh, the four table. Hey, kills him. Well, that's cool. I'll take an advance. Dangerous because I'm putting myself in zones. What happens if I get a retreat? I'm dead. Well, we want to get rid of him. Uh, so I'm on the six table. Ah, uh, dead anyway. All right. Well, I'm going to pause here and play out some more. I think it's totally over for the Abwehr. They have no real chance. All they really have is these couple of units, and they're not able to reach Hitler, so they're not able to kill him. So the question is, how much of the SS can they wipe out? Well, there's a lot more SS and Nazis on the board than there are of them. We'll see. Well, now we're at a stage where all the Abwehr units are inverted. They've all already gone. Still have a bunch of... Uh, SS aligned units. None of them terribly powerful and not much they can do. They're too far away but I want to get them in as a shield between Hitler and whatever's left. There's not much left that can do anything. This guy's about the only decent strength one. And he's going to be too weak to kill Hitler but he may be able to cause some damage before he goes down. Well now we're on the second coup turn. I'm going to look for leaders who might be useful to freeze. Who's Schelborg? 
002. That's this guy. I'm going to freeze him. Keep him from making an attack this turn. That'll help. Uh, anyone else low numbered? 8 Raider. I don't see him. Some of them are probably dead. We've got best. That no, doesn't seem very valuable. All right, well, that's the best I think I can do. And now I get to launch another attack. And I'll try to do what I can with it. I'm only a plus three, though, with the Abware now, because the Hitler's not dead, and I've got very little time to try to wipe out what I can with insufficient forces. Well, here we move into the third coup turn, and it's essentially over. I mean, it was last turn. It is just consistently getting worse. Uh, I'm not even going to play any to try to... There isn't much here. 101, if I had them, would be worth it. But there's just nothing that's worth playing to stop the movement. I've got one good unit left. This guy's still around. That's all I'm going to activate. I'm at a big plus one, which I can at least get a shot off on him. You know, this. Hey, let's see if we can take someone down with him. Uh, hiding. In these could be a value, conceivably, uh, and then popping out and forcing him to take one turn to try to kill him. But that means losing, because the best I can hope for is an allied victory at that point. So at plus four total here, get a defender retreat. I'm going to follow, and I'm going to attack again. Same odds. Plus four, a five. That's a, a mask. It's not sufficient for what I want. Plus one, I can't do anything. I can't kill that way. I'll do it again at plus four. I get another defender retreat. That removes the mask. No reason to advance. No reason not to. Really, there's nothing here. Let's see if we can wipe him out. If so, it's over. Right, I'm going to call it here because he just got wiped out eventually uh, by this guy chasing him. The things that are left are all killable. It, just no point in playing it out to the bitter end because the guys who are hiding in the fortresses can wait until the last coup turn and pop out and they'll be destroyed there's almost no question of that or neutralized or whatever so uh, I'm, I'm gonna just call this one at this point and load it up for you because I think the result is clear obviously I made some big mistakes uh, especially with the Abbar had some trouble early on figuring out what they should be doing it's a lot easier to play the defensive and react as the SS than it is to play the Abwehr and try to f understand how to how to uh, how to win the game without exposing yourself. Um, it's tricky though defending your headquarters. That's probably the biggest single thing. And if someone like uh, Himmler gets himself parked in there, it's going to be almost impossible to remove him from it. Even so, uh, it wasn't that far from a potential win when the coup started. You know, I mean, yes, it was a complete blowout, but a little bit more, a little bit better positioning, a little bit better, uh, a little bit more of force, and there might have been a good shot at getting Hitler or getting... Uh, a good well you got to get Hitler because otherwise you can't just keep you can't you can't keep rolling the other option of course is wiping out all their good units if they didn't have many but they did have several so uh, I think it was a good learning game I'm hoping those who watch it 
get a little something out of it, I'll be back with a review.